Hey everyone, Mel Day, Mel Day, Mel Day. I'm gonna just knock out whatever I got today. Mel are probably scattered about, but I got my Ipsy, my Boxy Charm, and my Sephora box. I, I peeked in, in, it, in it all already. This is the best in glow. There's a little card there, but I already took it out so I don't lose it. What it looks like inside. It gives you information. You're able to scan the products too for information. Because I that, that I like. This is a little bag. I haven't been too satisfied with Sephora, but there's things in there that I do like. The bags are cute and different products. This one I'm pretty happy with, except for one thing in there. I'll show you. But yeah, that's the bag. Glow getter. Glow the glow getter. Pretty neat little bags, kind of cool. Okay, that's uh, for since I've gotten these boxes so far, received these boxes. They've had these bags. It's different from Ipsy and Boxy Charm. I don't think it's ever given a bag, but it's different. I put perfumes in them and whatnot. Anyways, jumping on in, I'm gonna show you what I'm very excited about because I can't hold hold it in. I am very excited. I got this. It's Glam Go Glow. Oh my gosh. I wanted to buy it. I wanted to try it. But it's like $40 to $50 or $60 something. It's ridiculously expensive. And I seen the Sonic the Hedgehog one. The blue one. With the graveyard girl. I really wanted it. But it's expensive. So I'm glad I got the sample so I can at least try it, see if I like it, because I don't want to buy anything that expensive and not like it, because I'm pretty nitpicky about stuff. If, if I like it, I like it. If I don't, I don't, and I don't like wasting money. Anyways, it's the Glam Go Glow. It's a mask. This one's the Thirsty Mug. Mud. Mug. 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 Mud. Oh, what color is it? I don't want to open it, really. It's like a silver. I'm gonna give that a try. I'll probably review it, see how it goes. I've never tried these product, and I've been wanting to. It's just expensive. I, I have problems spending that much money on myself sometimes, all the time. Next thing is Repica, Repica lipstick on Chicago 1952 night blush and rice powder female fragrance. This one, I smelt it because last box, I, it stunk. And this one, it it smells like a lipstick, like the old-fashioned lipsticks, like they had a certain smell to it. Almost like that and almost like, like the lipstick and it's, it has a sweet smell. This is unique. I like it. It doesn't, I think it will irritate my nose too much. But this, it smells good. Like I said in one video, as I see all my swatches from my other video. I wish I can just, you can smell it through the video so you can know what I'm talking about because sometimes I can't explain it. Sorry, I'm hyped up on coffee and lack of sleep. Got off work at 7 a.m. Try to sleep some before running my errands. Jay's painting. All right, no jibber jabber. You guys want to see the products. Illuminating primer. I like primers. I don't know about the illuminating part. I got one that was illuminating from somebody, some brand. I didn't care for it because it made my face really shiny and I'm oily as is and it just was too much. There's no really scent to it. There is a shimmer. I will give it a try because as you see, I, I am, this is a matte foundation I have and I still get shimmery look. I don't know why it, it bugs me. I don't want to be too shiny. Weird, yeah. And the next thing is a cream sherbet hydrating moisturizing. Is it a face moisturizer? Yeah, face and neck. There's no smell, which is good. Sometimes facial products, when they smell, no smell. Smooth. 
Let me see what it says. Is it good for oily skin? I have oily skin and sometimes when it's oily product. Let me see. Rejuvenating and lightweight, this luscious gel cream hydrates and softens skin while visibly calm redness and congestion. Your face can have congestion? Didn't know that. Well, it doesn't say it just it's lightweight I'll try it see how it goes I'm always in for different face washes face lotions it makes yeah, I'm trying different stuff I used to stick to just and Mary Kay I tried a L'Oreal one no or was it pounds I don't know it didn't do good on my face anyways next thing is this rose gold it says rose gold rose gold Alora Massier. I heard good things about this brand. See. <laughs> that kind of looks funny. I'm not gonna say what. But yeah. Ooh, this is a pretty color. I don't think that's like a rose gold too much, but it's pretty. Hmm, I like it. It's pretty. So far, I've liked everything in the box. Last thing, something I do not like, and I don't know why people, they keep sending me pink stuff. It's a pink gel lip gloss. I'm not even going to open it. I'm going to send it to somebody else. I like a lip gloss, but ever since I got the, started getting the matte lipsticks, I... I haven't cared for lip gloss, but one thing I don't care for is pink too much. Uh, pink doesn't look good on me, I think, and it's just, I do have a pink just in case, because I like to match sometimes what I'm wearing. This one I'm not going to keep, I'm going to probably give it to one of my nieces or something. Christmas is coming up, so I might give it to them. Uh, I do like Sephora products. This is a Sephora brand. What is it? It's Pinna Pink. I'm more of a berries. I like reds. I like... I've been wearing nudes too. And I like those colors. And if it's a pink, it's like a mauve pink. If you know what I mean? Like a nude pink. This is too bright for me. Anyways... I, I'm happy what I got overall though. I'm excited about really trying this. I'm going to try it on my day off if I have a chance. Uh, everything's in the product. It's $10. If you guys don't know how much it is, it's $10 a month. They pull it out of your account. There's a, about a month or so waiting on the wait list. And then once you're on, it's easy peasy and you get it each month. So far I've gotten it since June. June, July, August, September, October, November. Is it my sixth one? Or is it July is my first one? Sixth one? June, July, August, September, October, November. Yeah. And they each one had a bag. And the first three I didn't really care for. Maybe one item. This one's actually overall pretty good. And it's Sephora. You can sign up on their app or online. Um... Sephora Play. Yeah, it's only it's only ten dollars. I can spend a lot and ten dollars and get only one product sometimes. But you ever take and plus they give you a card for points if you save those points. You get forty five points, which is pretty nifty. Overall, not bad. Um, you guys have a great Friday, a great weekend. I will see you guys in my next video. I'm going to try to get some sleep before my 11 o'clock shift tonight. If my son will let me. <laughs> Anyways, you guys have a great weekend. I will see you guys in my next video.